Hello, Fernando. Hello, Juan Carlos. Hello, Raul. Hey, Raul, ¿qué se había hecho? No lo habíamos visto. ¿Cómo está? All right. Welcome, welcome. Hello, Wendy. Hello, Ruth. Hello, Maria. Good evening, teacher. Good evening. Hello, Jacqueline. Hello, hello. How are you? Are you ready for your English class? Where yes, teacher. teacher. All right. Uh, who can tell me what information do you remember about yesterday's class? What information do you remember from yesterday's class? What do you recall? I'm going to and will be. That is correct. That is correct. We were practicing going to for the future. So uh, right now we are going to review. Vamos a repasar el going to for future. Veo caras nuevas que se me habían desaparecido, pero veo que ya estamos acá. All right. Es, vamos a repasar and then we continue. Second question, where are you going to go? You might and everybody have decided here? to take your vacation and you might yes, yes, yes. go. All right, and excellent. Then, again, you might excellent. not. So if you're sure about it, then you're going to use the expressions towards the left. You're going to use be going to plus, um, you know, whatever complement that exists. So you're going to use, I'm going to go to Europe. All right, that could be um, your plan. But if you don't know, you haven't decided on, I'm not sure of where I'm going to go. I guess I'll travel, but I don't know where. And so you'll use the expressions towards the right side of this chart. Hi, everyone. By the end of this class, you'll right. learn how Please to talk about future notes. Problems. You'll also take learn notes. how to use be going to and, and will the people that were present yesterday for you example, can help me I'm gonna go to with France the people that were vacation. not here I'm not and sure what place I'll we'll visit yet but I think I'll questions. visit the Eiffel Tower so please pay attention the topic is future will plus before be going I explain to. the grammar involved in this lesson I would like to play an audio program to illustrate how this topic is used your task is to listen carefully and take notes as I'll ask a few questions about this listening activity at the end. I'm so excited. We have two weeks off. What are you going to do? I'm not sure. I guess I'll just stay home. Maybe I'll hang out with my friends and watch some movies. What about you? Any plans? Yeah, I'm going to relax at the beach with my cousin. We're going to go surfing every day. And my cousin likes to fish, so maybe we'll go fishing one day. Sounds like fun. Say, why don't you come with us? Do you mean it? I'd love to. I'll bring my surfboard. That's great. The more the merrier. By the way, where are we going to stay? Oh, we can stay at my aunt and uncle's beach house. They have plenty of room, and I'm sure they'll be happy to have guests. I'll call in tonight to let them know what time we're going to arrive. I guess we'll leave pretty early. There's a direct bus every morning at 5 a.m. That's fine with me. I think I'll be too excited to sleep. Now let me present this structure. What we want to do in this lesson is learn how to talk about future plans using...
Okay. Let's analyze this section. Uh, who can tell me in what situation you are going to use a B plus going to plus base form of the verb? In what situation are you going to use these right here? In the situation when we have plants and the plants is not changed. Correct, correct. When you have solid plants, something that is not going to change, something that you already put on your agenda. Can you give me some examples? Uh, can you give me some examples of uh, when you are going to use uh, be going to? in your real life? In your real life, in what situation will you use be plus going to? Um, well, I am going to work uh, tomorrow. Very good. I am going to work tomorrow is a good example because that is something that you are not going to change, right? You say, I am going to work tomorrow. Very good. Uh, yes, Ruth, another example. Then Maria, another example. I am going to um, go. At the school, my son. I am going to go to my son's. Uh, to a school. Ah, okay. School. Very ah, good. Okay. Excellent. I am going Moral. to go to my son's school tomorrow. Awesome. Awesome. Thank you, okay. uh, Maria. I am going to get up at five tomorrow. I am going to get up at five tomorrow. Excellent, excellent. Yes, Wendy, another example. I am going to wake up at 6 a.m. tomorrow. I am going to wake up at 6 a.m. tomorrow. Excellent, excellent. Another example, another example. I am going to uh, study English class in the night, tomorrow in the night. Okay, I am going to study English class tomorrow night. Perfect. Perfect. All right. Another example. Another example. Juan Carlos. I am going to drive there to Salco tomorrow. I am going to drive to Isalco tomorrow. Hey, bring me some Isalco coffee. Yeah. <laughs> That's okay. Excellent. Thank you, Juan Carlos. Okay, another example. Another example. I am going to soccer school for my son in Saturday. I am going to my son's soccer school on Saturday. I am going to my son's soccer school on Saturday. Awesome, awesome. Okay. So all of these guys are examples that we can use. Uh, be 
going to. At this moment, does anybody have any questions about this topic? Questions about this topic at this moment? Anybody, anybody, somebody, give me a question. You don't remember the questions from yesterday? Are you going to study tonight? Will you have fun this Friday night? Are you going to meet friends today? Nobody, nobody remember the questions? Hmm. I wonder who has not been studying the class. Hmm. I wonder who has not been looking at the questions. All right, I just shared the questions with you right now. Let me have two volunteers. Two volunteers. One student is going to ask the question. All right, Ruth, ask the question. Another volunteer, respond to the question. Somebody, 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 somebody. Si no practica, no mejora. Remember that if you don't practice, you don't improve. You got to practice. Thank you, Maria. Excellent. All right. So we have Ruth and Maria. Uh, Ruth, I want you to ask the questions. And Maria, I want you to respond to the questions. Everybody listen, please. Action. Teacher, um, I have una pregunta. Son las yes. últimas que usted puso ayer. Are you going to study tonight? Sí, sí. Las okay. acabo de, las acabo de re, reenviar en el grupo del chat. Ah, okay, okay. Okay, uh, Maria, are you going to study tonight? No, I'm not going to study. Okay, will you have fun this Friday night? I don't think so. Uh, I have a baby so I can go out to have fun on Friday. Okay, are you going to meet friends today? No, I'm not. Okay, will you talk talk to your parents soon? Soon? Yes, uh, maybe I will talk with them this coming weekend. Okay, will it rain today? Maybe it will rain. Okay, it is going to be sunny tomorrow. I hope so that it's going to be uh, sunny tomorrow. Okay, uh, will this year be a good year? Um, I hope at the end of the year is going to be a good year. Right now, uh, it is not a good year, but I hope at the end it's going to be a, a good year. Okay. Um, That's right. Remember, nothing is forever. Nothing is forever. The only thing that is promised in this world is change. Nothing is forever. Nothing is permanent. So don't worry about what's going on right now. It's going to pass. Okay. Um, will you wear the same clothes tomorrow? No, I will not. I will use a different clothes. Okay. Um, 
Are you are humans going to live on Mars someday? I don't think so. Uh, we are just going to live here in, in the Earth. Mars, it's far away. Okay, will being able to speak English is still be a useful skill in the future? Yes, I think English is going to be use, useful in the future. Uh, also, another language, maybe Mandarin, but English is still. Uh, Man Mandarin yeah. and Russian. Russian. Russian are going to be strong languages. Okay, um, when will you get, get home today? Uh, when it's referred about the time. Ajá. Eh, no, no, no. En este caso eh, está asumiendo que no está en casa y le está preguntando cuándo ah. llegarás a casa. Usted como ya está en casa le puede decir ya estoy en casa. Right now I am at my home. Uh -huh. You can say I am already home. Okay. Um, when will this class be finished? Oh, next, class, next Thursday. The class next. is going to finish next Thursday. Uh huh. Yeah. Uh, remember, guys, tomorrow we have class. Uh, and then Monday, uh, Friday, no class. Saturday, no class. Sunday, no class. But next week, Monday, class. Tuesday, class. Wednesday, class. Thursday, last class. After that, we're done. We're finished. Um, you move forward. You go to intermediate three and uh, keep moving, keep practicing, uh, you know. Remember that, you, I'm sorry? Are you going to be our teacher? Yeah, I don't think so, I don't think so. Uh, maybe in the advanced levels, uh, I'm gonna take a break. I'm gonna take a break uh, from teaching. Uh, for one or two months. Right now, it's real heavy for me. Uh, I got a lot of work. So right now, I'm I'm going to go ahead and uh, take a break from teaching. And I'm just going to dedicate my time to my other business. Take a break for us. <laughs> take a break from teaching. Yeah, yeah. Because, you know, I work. I work all day. So uh, I don't know what if you know what I do. But, you know, I start working early and I finish late. So for me, it's real heavy. So I, I need to take a break. I'm getting burned out. I'm doing too much. Okay. Yeah, it's not you guys. It's me. I'm, I'm tired. <laughs> uh, even though I love teaching, uh, it, is, it is for me, it's, uh, it's becoming... Um, I'm getting a little tired, so I'm just gonna take a little break. Once I get my rest, come back in action. All right. So, I hope so we can see you in two months. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I think that maybe in two months I'll come right back. I'll just take a little break. You know, August is coming next next month. So yeah, I think I'm I'm just gonna enjoy some time and uh, recuperate and then come back. Okay, uh, let's go ahead and give applause for the participants. Applause uh, for Maria and Ruth. Ruth says that she's having internet problems. There she is, welcome back, Ruth. Uh, we're going to change partners. Uh, Maria selects somebody and Ruth selects somebody. Okay, teacher. Um, I select to Raul Antonio. Raul Antonio. 
Antonio asked the question. I select Isabo. Isabo, eh, Isabo todavía va en transporte a casa o ya está en casa? Eh, todavía voy en transporte. Ok, uh, vamos a dejar que Isabo esté de oyente, todavía va en transcurso a su casa. ¿Alguien más? Claudia María. Claudia María. Claudia María. ¿Me escucha? Claudia María. ¿Estás ahí? Creo que Claudia María está de oyente también. Eh, creo que todavía está trabajando. ¿Alguien más? Herbert. 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 Okay. Excellent. Okay. okay. Raul asked the questions and Herbert responded to the questions. Okay. Raul. Herbert, I'm going you uh, are you going to study tonight? Uh, uh, yes, I am. Will you have fun this Friday night? Uh, uh, maybe for TV, I going to watch TV. The uh, games centroamericano. Are you going to meet friend today? Mm, friend? Uh, no, 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 I not. Will you tell to your parents songs? Mm, uh, my parents song? No, not yet. Maybe in vacation. Will it rain today? Uh, I don't believe because I was to read the 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 time the weather no uh, maybe no no rain tonight. Is it? It's going to be sunny tomorrow. Mm, tomorrow, uh, I don't believe it. Will this big year be a going year? Yes, 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 I will. Will you wear the sound clutter tomorrow? Uh, I won't because I tomorrow I'm going to stay in my house, uh, work in work in for in line. Are humans going to live on Mars on a day? I human going to live in Martin. Is a human going to live on Mars? Uh, teacher, what did what do you mean in Mars someday? Mars. Mars is Marte, un planeta que está a la par de Neptuno, allá por Júpiter, eh, cerca de Saturno. Por esos rumbos, ahí está Mars. Uh -huh, but, but I don't, I don't understand the question. Uh, ah, eh, si usted piensa que los seres humanos vivirán en el planeta Martes algún día. Uh, 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 Yo me uh, puedo ver allí haciendo una granjita. <laughs> <laughs> uh, I, I am not. Sure. It's a joke. It's a joke. Don't. Ahí es cuando. Don't like water. Don't like maybe. The, well, okay. Are we able to speak English until we use a skill in the future? 
Yes, I will. That's right. Uh, that's right. Uh, there are many platforms. There are many platforms. Will being a, will being able to speak English still be useful skill in the future? Será el inglés hablar el inglés una habilidad útil en el futuro? Yes, of course. Eh, yeah. Les voy a compartir un par de plataformas que yo he usado personalmente para okay. obtener trabajos online remotamente okay. desde casa y pagando súper bien. Hay wow. una que se llama Over Overpass. Este es una. O, o, overpass. Aquí los estoy escribiendo en el meeting ah, chat. Excelente, excelente. Eh, overpass está la otra es Up work que es muy útil y esta una que se llama transcribe me transcribe Yo había me. algunas encuestas ajá uh -huh. yeah. también hay de encuestas hay varias estas solo son tres que yo he usado pero hay mm -hmm. más que esas y allí hay desde asistente de secretario eh, yeah, de right, eso right. de eso de programar citas eh, wow. eso de billing hacer cobros eh, eso de ah transcribe me es de escribe lo que escuchas eh, mm -hmm. hay eso de servicio al cliente uh, asistente de profesor eh, oh my wow. god yeah usted hace su perfil y pone su precio, lo que usted quiere la hora, que ofrece su nivel de inglés, le van a pedir que se grabe, eh, que tome un par de exámenes de su inglés y, hey, you know, quién sabe, agarras un trabajo de gerente en Google, desde El Salvador. Ahora, eso es tu poder. Eso está a tu alcance, literalmente. Yo. Yeah. Yeah. That's very good, teacher. And uh, yeah, it's, yeah. It's, it is it is difficult to fill it up the, the application for get it. Yeah, yeah. It's not easy. It's not it's easy. Not e don't think, don't think that you will create a profile, <sighs> send your resume one time, record yourself one time. It's not like that. It's not like that, right? You got to sit there and, and pound it, pound it, pound it. Okay, the next one, the next one, the next one, the next one, until you find something. Hay una cosa que se llama data scraping. Data scraping, right? Data scraping, que paga muy bien en casa y no tienes que ni estar hablando inglés. Eh, si sí tienes que poderlo escri eh, escribir y copy paste, obviamente, pero es muy bien pagado, lo puedes hacer desde tu casa y ganar súper bien. Good. Thank you, teacher. Yeah, Thank yeah, you, you know, you know that my name is Michael King. <laughs> <laughs> bueno, my name is Rubén Santos, but everybody calls me Michael King. Teacher, <laughs> hey. what is level English need? Uh, it depends. It depends. Uh, hay posiciones de booking that you need intermediate English, right? Que es básicamente, hey, reservé una habitación y no tenían jabón. Oh, okay, ya pongo su queja. O, oh, you know, cositas así. Hey, necesito mover la fecha de... Uh, eh, reservé la habitación para el uno, pero la necesito mover para el dos. You know, no se necesita un inglés muy avanzado. La mayoría de ese tipo de trabajo que les estoy contando de hacer eh, booking es texto. Más que nada es textear con el cliente, contestar emails. Ok. Y hay posiciones así también. Eh, un, otra que es fácil es data scraping. Eh, bueno, lo que hago yo. Eh, programar citas eh, para gerentes, right? Digamos, eh, mira, quiero vender mi casa. Eh, ok, quiere vender su casa. Sí, ok. 
¿Podemos programar una visita para mañana a la una de la tarde? Sí. Ok, excelente. Eh, mañana llegará un especialista que compra casas y él le va a hacer cuánto le podemos ofrecer. En esta área mía ya tienes que tener un inglés más avanzado porque estás comprando casa básicamente. Right? Pero si haces, por ejemplo, booking, eh, eso de reservas o esto de data scraping, you know, lo puedes hacer fácilmente en tu casa. Uh -huh. I believe you only have one, one, one word, only teach English teachers. Ah, yeah, yeah, no. No, I, uh, I actually work uh, in the United States online. Ah, too. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Wow. Yeah, yeah. That's why I need a break uh, from teaching English because I work all day, so my brain uh, is tired, yes. you know, I want to sleep. Yeah, yeah. Okay, uh, let me have uh, the next one. Okay, guys, we're gonna go ahead and move forward. I need to take the attendance. I need to take the attendance. So when I call your name, please say present. We're gonna take the attendance. When I call your name, please say present. Are you ready? Are you ready? Yes. I'm ready. Ready, ready teacher. Let's do it. Let's do it. Let's do it. Okay. Let me see. Give me one second, please. There it is. And we got Adriana. Present. Present. Good job, Adriana. Today is the fifth. The fifth, the fifth present. Carlos. Present teacher. Awesome. Claudia. Present teacher. Very good. Dorivel. Dorivel. Yo creo que ella reportó que tiene problemas con el internet. Eh, Esmeralda. Esmeralda. Awesome. It's absent. Okay. Eh, Herbert. Present. Present. Good job. Irma. Present, teacher. Very good. Isabo. Isabo va en el transporte. Good. Eh, Jacqueline Guevara. Jacqueline Guevara. Eh, absent, ok. Si ven que escribe en el WhatsApp o en el eh, chat del Zoom, por favor, me avisa. Please. Eh, Jacqueline Cermello. Present teacher. Present. Good job. Eh, Juan Cubillas dijo que iba en transporte también, iba manejando. Eh, I, I, I present teacher. I, I, I am driving. Okay. okay. Excellent. Juan Cubillas is present. Okay. Thank, you. Thank you, Juan. Juan Maravilla. Present teacher. Good job, Juan Maravilla. Carla. Present teacher. Thank you, Carla. Leana. Leana is absent. Okay, Leana. Luis. Present. Good job, Luis. Marco Quijano. Marco Quijano. Pensé verlo en el... Ok, Marco Quijano is absent. Ok, Marco Quijano is absent. Marco Quijano, absent. 
Marco Ramírez. Present teacher. All right, Marco. Maria. Present teacher. Excellent. Marina. Absent. Noemi. Noemi. Is absent. Raul. Present teacher. Thank you. Rene. Present teacher. Excellent. Roberto. Roberto. Absent. Ruth. Your teacher. Hey, Ruth. Saul. Present teacher. Excellent. Wendy. Present teacher. Very good. All right. So we have absent Roberto, Noemi, Marina, Marco Quijano, Leana, absent, Jacqueline Guevara, absent, Esmeralda, Doribel, absent. All right. Tenemos varios absent. Present teacher. Eh, ¿Quién es present? Doribel Arriaza. Ah, ok, Doribel, bienvenida. Thank you, present. Ok, ¿alguien más? Teacher, there was Hi. a message, there was a chat. Is Carla Orellana son, or got a problem with the computer. Ah, ok, ok. Ah, sí, aquí lo vi. Ok, está... Karen. Ah, Ruth. Ok, dice, se me inició. Rebeca dice, tengo problemas con internet. And then Francisca Spa dice, me disculpas, pero aún voy manejando. ¿Será ella? Ok, no, bueno. Ok. All right, uh, let's go ahead and move forward, guys. We're gonna go ahead and take a look at the next section. Uh, we're gonna practice knowledge check. We're going to look at the listening activity. Vamos a hacer a listening 5.3. Eh, si ya lo hizo, comparta sus respuestas con sus compañeros. Si no lo ha hecho, lo vamos a hacer en este momento. And then we're going to check. Are you ready? Are you ready? Yes, I'm ready. Sure. Okay. Yes, All right. Ready? Let's go. Si ve que sus compañeros no están participando en el grupo, me avisa para ir a supervisar. Los que están de oyente, quédense en la sala principal para que los demás puedan eh, practicar. Ready? Let's go. <coughs>
Hello, teacher. I hello, think hello. I, I am alone. <laughs> okay, let me put you with um let me put you with Saul, he's alone too. Saul okay. is on five. Ah, aquí está Herbert. Okay, vamos a poner a, a Saul con María Aguirre. Herbert, ¿estás aquí? Herbert, can you hear me? Yes, I hear. Okay, okay. Herbert, practice with Irma, please. Okay. Pueden compartir sus pantallas. Uh, Thanks, teacher. Continue, 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 continue. Solo los estoy escuchando. Eh, voy a poner a Wendy con ustedes porque Wendy no tiene pareja. Estamos ya las terminamos. Adriana y Raúl. Ok, compartan con Wendy. Ya viene para acá. Ok, vamos a poner a Wendy aquí para que le compartan a ella. Hola, Wendy. Hi, teacher. Good evening. When did you finish the class? Yes, one? yes, yes. yes. Okay, read the answers. Read the questions. Okay. Um, Jane, Jane like her new apartment because uh, it's a cheaper than her old apartment. Uh, number two. Said wants to live downtown because uh, he wants works to... there. Oh, no. Number two. Uh -huh. He works, works there. Um, number three. Karen's apartment is too small. Next, uh, though wishes his new apartment were on the first floor. Vale. Okay. Uh, only for a uh, question answer. ¿Cuáles le faltan a usted, Juan Carlos? ¿Cómo? ¿Cuáles le faltan a usted? Ah, voy en el 4.5. Y usted ya terminó todo. Sí, yo ya finalicé todo. Eh, yo voy por el 4.5. Si quieres resolvemos eso. Solo que, bueno, ahorita voy a empezar a manejar. Pero igual lo puede resolver, no te preocupes. Uh -huh. ya. Este, ¿ya está ahí en la plataforma? O... Sí, este, yo él te lo estoy viendo del, del teléfono. Ah, ok. Este, dice, which is not those, this recipe describe. Describe la, describe la receta, dice, ok. No, eh, se pregunta que de qué, como de qué snack o de qué refrigerio, de qué refrigerio este, describe la, como la receta que dice ahí, que después comienza con when the kernels start to pop. When the kernels start to pop. Take snake. the pain, pain gen, no, I shake, gen, every few shake seconds. The Toast, eh, toasted bagel. Ese es, no sé cómo lo tiene usted. 
No. O pizza, ese, pan pizza. Los pan no. de pizza. Porque pregunta que cuando la, como las semillas comienzan a explotar, hay que como sacudir la cacerola o la olla. Así como. Ah, pero poco. Uh -huh. Las palomitas de maíz. Ah. Sí. What is the last is the, in the making what commodity? Next addition to ¿Cuál es ahí la dos next ad cilantro? ¿Qué es lo que se le debe al guacamole? Ajá, o sea, pero, pero la pregunta dice que cuál es el último paso al hacer guacamole. Finale uh, sería la primera. Finale uh, agregar sal. Uh -huh. Finally chile. add a little salt. Ah, no, pepper. pimienta y chile. Uh -huh. Sauce que es, es chile, ¿verdad? Salsa picante. O okay. sal, chile líquido. What's the first in the making of toasted bagel? Fierce Toast. Esa es la tres. Fierce Toast. Todas. No. Eh, se pregunta no. que cuál es el primer paso para hacer un bagel tostado. Entonces, vale, la primero. primera opción dice primero. Es creo que es como que significa este. Es, Ponerle queso crema y después servir. La segunda opción dice primero cortar a la mitad. Y la tercera opción dice primero tostarlo. Y no es eso el primer paso, tostarlo. No, este, el pan de béisbol no, no lo ha visto. No, no sé qué. Es, no. es uno redondito que tiene un huequito en medio. Entonces ese primero se parte a la mitad y después All right, all right. Is everybody finished? No, teacher. Ahorita estamos aquí resolviendo. All right, that's okay. We're gonna do it together. Uh, let's look at the first one. Let me have one volunteer. One volunteer. Number one. One volunteer, number one. Yo, teacher. Okay, go ahead. Uh, where are the girls going to stay? Is uh, answer at a relative's beach house. Very good. At a relative's beach house. Excellent. Okay. Repeat, repeat. Relatives. Relatives. Perdón. Relatives. 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 All right. Number. Okay. Thank you. Number two. A volunteer. <laughs> Carla. Uh, she's going to go to the beach with her cousin. Excellent. She's going to go to the beach with her cousin. Perfect. Number three, one volunteer. Number three, one volunteer. Jacqueline. Go fishing. Go fishing. Perfect. Number four, number four. I'm going to go camping. I am going to go camping. Perfect. And the last one, number five, Carla. Maybe I will leave around the end of June. Excellent. <laughs> Maybe I will leave around the end of June. Awesome, awesome. Okay, good job, guys. 
Uh, at this moment, does anybody have any questions related to this exercise? Oh, we are finished. We're now going to be looking at the final exam. Listening. I would like for you to work in pairs and complete the listening section. And then we're going to check together. Work in pairs, complete the listening activity, and then we're going to check together. Ready, let's go. De, de este, bueno, yo voy manejando, pero ahora voy a ver aquí cuál es el examen final. Ok, teacher, eh, solo estoy con él y él va manejando todavía. Ok, ya vamos a cambiar el grupo. Um, permítame, acabar, ya estoy en el examen final. 5.3. Ese es el 5.3 o no? Terminaron. Yo sí, ya tengo finalizado ese. Yo voy manejando. Creo que lo voy a hacer más noche cuando regrese a casa. Y cualquier cosa, les pido ayuda mañana, si no, no entiendo algo. ¿eh? Ok. Ok. Bueno, aquí hay como siete ¿no? en el grupo. O sea que todos lo terminaron ya. Yo sí. Yo creo que... I finished already. Ah, ya ven cómo lo humillan a uno, solo porque uno no ha terminado y ya le están diciendo huevón a uno. Ah, va, está bueno. All right, read the exercise. Teacher. Me pareció escuchar la voz del teacher, me voy a conectar porque no, no me pega bien la señal. Voy All right. manejando ahorita. Okay, thank you. All right, read the question, read the exercise. Okay, I can read the first one. Jane likes her new apartment because she's cheaper than her old apartment. <laughs> Uh, the next is uh, said wants to live downtown because he works there. Next question is Karen 
apartment is too small. The next, though, wishes his new apartment were on the first floor. All right, let me have the first volunteer. I would like for us to look at the first one. Uh, Jen likes her new apartment because... It has two rooms. It has two bedrooms. Bathroom. <laughs> good, good, thank you. Seth wants to live downtown because... Carla. He works there. He works there. Excellent. Right. Eso es en la primera. Ese no es esa la respuesta. Oh, really? What is the respuesta? Yes, it's, it's cheaper than her old apartment. Okay, it's cheaper than her old apartment. Okay, okay. Thank you. Thank you. At number three, Karen's apartment is Wendy. Too small, teacher. Too small. All right, Adriana, Doug, Doug wishes his new apartment were? On the first floor. On the first floor. Good job. Good job. All right, guys. Looks like. You got this. Please continue working on the platform and I will see you tomorrow. Good night. Teacher, I have a question. Yes. Eh, hoy, ten, eh, entre hoy y mañana hay que finalizar este, este examen. Correct. Okay, y entonces la próxima semana que vamos a hacer? Review. Okay. Thank you, teacher. Thank you. Okay, guys. Bye-bye. Bye. 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 Good night. Bye. Good night. Good night.